Hey there, folks! So, just finished my DS battle number 144, and with it, that means I have just finished another update cycle. Uh, now, what do I mean by update cycle? Uh, update cycle, I mean that I have 12 currently active teams, if you count my Challenge Cup quote-unquote team. Uh, and basically, what I, I, I rotate through each and every one of them before I'll repeat a team. So if I have an, a battle with my RU team, you won't see another battle with that RU team for another 12 battles. So yeah, just finished an update cycle. This next update cycle, the one that's coming up, is going to be special because I'm adding four new teams to the lineup. Two of them are boring standard teams. Uh, one of them is a PU team. Uh, I'm really excited about that, although come Ju July 1st, I'm going to have to completely redo it thanks to the changes in the tiers, or at least what's most likely going to happen uh, with the changes in the tiers. Uh, another new team is going to be a new Ubers team. I've already had my first battle with that team. Uh, a third new team is going to be a Dreamworld OU team. That is going to be the first non-Challenge Cup team that I'm Poke-saving. Uh, Poke-saving because you obviously cannot have a Dreamworld team with unreleased Dreamworld abilities that you didn't hack somehow. So that's just gonna, that's actually, I'm gonna use that as an opportunity to have a lot of fun and to try a lot of things that normally I wouldn't try because you know, it takes so long to breed a team, uh, and, you know, it's, I'm going to try a lot of the really cool things you can attempt in Dreamworld OU that you can't in the standard metagames because this stuff isn't released yet. Now, that leaves one slot, and I considered what to put in that slot. I thought, well, should I put in another Little Cup team, um, a doubles or triples team, a rotation team? And then I thought, eh, nah. Uh, instead, what I wanted to do is leave that spot open for basically a wild card. Uh, something that basically it's a meta a, a battle in a metagame that is not popular enough that I could reliably get battles for that tier. Uh, you know, one, even once an update cycle, that's once every 16 battles, which is you know, less than once a month, really. Uh, but, I mean, there are a lot of really obscure metagames out there that I would like to uh, you know, dip my toe in the water for. Uh, middle Cup, for instance, Rotation is another example, uh, but also previous generation stuff. So Gen 4, Gen 3, Gen 2, Gen 1, uh, yeah, even Gen 1. I, it would be fun to make a uh, red-blue team and find someone to battle with and have just, you know, a random red-blue battle. I just think that would be cool. Uh, so, yeah, so my 16th slot is going to be left open for this wild card kind of team. and to decide what kind of battles I'm going to have in that slot, I am going to ask you, my loyal subscribers, what what do you want to see? What do you want to see in that slot? Uh, at least for this update cycle. Do you want to see me do rotation? Do you want to see me do uh, gold, silver, crystal, UU? -U? Uh, I'm totally open to that. Uh, the only thing is that I need to be able to find an opponent. So if you tell me, hey, Antar, I want you to battle... Gen 1 Middle Cup, you have to also then say, and I'm willing to put together a team to battle you. Obviously, you don't have to, uh, you know, legitimately get and raise such a team. Um, but it, you can't say, I want to have this battle with you and put it on, po and we have this battle on Pokemon Online and Pokemon Showdown. It has to be something that is playable either on the DS or on an emulator over Hamachi. Uh, and you know, I'll, I'll get into the details of how that works once I actually find them out myself. Um, but I'll, I'll cross that bridge when I come to it. But basically, if you say that you want to see me do a battle in a, in a metagame, you have to also basically volunteer to be my opponent. So, with that in mind, what do you want to see? Tell me. I am open to all suggestions. I will not tell you no. The only thing is that it cannot be something that I currently do, and as I said, it has to be something that is playable on the DS or on an emulator. Uh, also, no PBR. I do my PBR battle separately. Um, so that's all, folks. Post what you think. Um, I really, really am anxious to hear what you guys come up with. 